Hello? Hi. This is uh, a gay and non-gay uh, episode three. I just, I'm just setting the studio up. Dan's actually gone to the loo. Uh, I bet he's not. Did I sound Australian then? Dan's gone to the loo. <laughs> oh, he's back. Hang on. Hi, Dan. I, I've already started. So the thing is, the thing is, I've actually, I've been in Soho drinking tonight. Oh, God. And um, Why I have you had, done that? What? Why? Because I was waiting for you. And I've basically, I, well, I just left a load of hot guys to be here with you. So <laughs> you look so unimpressed. <laughs> what? What do you want from me? Where have you been? I've been in various bars, and no, I don't know. I just had a few drinks with my friend. It's fine. So anyway, we're here because Talia, Dan's girlfriend, is actually. Can you explain it? Because I can't be bothered. Basically, yes, my girlfriend is uh, Talia, and she's in New York currently, uh, leaving me on my own. Uh, James is her good friend and best friend. Um, best friend. Best friend. But you're James Shade. Shade. You know there's a James Wan. Don't even start on the James Wan, James <laughs> 2 argument. I was so furious that you brought that up. How I, I, I think dare you? How dare you? But you I, mean, you I will... know I'm James 2, but I'm working on it. You've well, got, uh, oh, so where's James 1 right now then, hey? Why is he not looking after Talia's boyfriend? It's true, actually. I've, I've not had any feedback from uh, James 1 regarding, not, regarding no. this podcast. Right. No. So James 1 has been demoted to James 2, if not James 3. Okay. James 1 is now me. Anyway, sorry, you just really hit on a nerve there, that's all. Sorry. No, I've met James One, he's lovely, but he's not James Two. Well, uh, James well, apparently two. now he is. <laughs> <laughs> the thing is, this is a classic problem. Like, a lot of friends have a James One, a James Two, a James Three. So, my girlfriend Talia, actually, she is Talia One, but I also know another Talia who I've actually known for longer. So, an... hang on. So, Talia Two, you've known longer than Talia One? Yeah. So, how did Talia Two get demoted to Talia Two? Well, she was just Talia. Yeah. Initially. But then your girlfriend Talia won whole upon, position. Upon girlfriend Talia arriving, there was suddenly a need to uh, number the two. <laughs> and because I was, I was you, going so out you, with her, that was she was number one. But you demoted. I didn't, I didn't demote her because it's quite a rare name. Until you meet a second one, you don't have to number them, do you? So then you numbered just, the one you met first to number two. Yeah. I, well, I, well, then therefore, as I'm more amazing than James one, everyone listening to this is really bored right now, but you get my point, right? So what we're doing now is we're going to discuss your life choices right okay you brought the angels with me guys i feel quite disrespectful actually because i'm i've probably had too much to drink to be touching them right and they're probably going to judge me but basically the angels they're, the, they're called the angels of light and <laughs> the look dad's giving me and um basically the angels are a high spiritual being obviously you've heard of them um they come from the heart of god as guides protectors helpers and healers and basically they're willing to help us like throughout our lives all the time all we need to do is like call on them and they'll respond so these cards help us bring the angels into our life so you kind of like lay them all out and you ask them a question and then what will happen is they'll give you a response so what's about to happen is is very spiritual right very spiritual where, where have you procured these from my okay. friend bought them for me for my birthday and i've done them with my friend shelly loads so so instruction card one approach the use of the angel of light cards with reverence although the angels have a sense of humor and take themselves lightly they are pure spiritual beings and it's appropriate for you to hold the cards quietly and bless them before you ask your question a prayer or invocation for help before you make your request will raise the vibration of the cards so they'll hear you more easily and enable the angels to connect easier with you okay it also says you might like to meditate before using the cards but that might be quite boring for everyone listening so let's just skip that step um so when you've asked your question okay <laughs> so when you've asked your question with your left hand pick from the pack or from a fan of cards three that you feel inspired to choose card one card two and card three and then i'll explain what card one card two and card three are when we get to them okay so if you wouldn't mind i'm going to get the angel cards out now a question would be, are my girlfriend and I good together? Or am we I cheating? Ask that. We're going to go with that. We're going to talk about Talia. You want to go deep. This is, like, well, don't uh, take this lightly. This is hugely... The, why is why is she... What is the purpose of this if we're just going to go, oh, should I watch The Apprentice? Okay, we well, no, but yes, like, so what she... is the big question in your life at the minute? Like, genuinely, what's the question in your life? Um, should I watch The Apprentice? That's kind of the forefront thing in what's my mind. Well, that's a ridiculous question. Um, if that's your biggest problem right now you really need to sort your life out well get more problems i don't well <laughs> no, but like so do you uh, go on okay, no just, no please you don't believe in this surely yeah i do i've done this with no, my friend you fr don't 
I do. Oh, why are you, why are you, I'm really religious. This is not genuine. Religious. Right? No, when I was this, school, not the, this is not the, it the is. word of God. No, of course it's it not. It is. It's the angels. The angels from where? Heaven. I have an eight star in RE, GCC, right. and I'm a son of a preacher, man. Qu- hang on, sorry. Did you just quote <laughs> Dusty Springfield lyrics? <laughs> that's the gayest thing ever. Well, Are quick. you seriously a non-gay? Do you know the lyrics? Well, of course we're, we're I do. That what? It's an enormous song. Man. Oh, my God. I'm literally crying. I mean, I've always liked that song because I, it applies to me. By the way, everyone listening, this is a box. Um, there's some guy on this who I can only assume is supposed to be Jesus. It's not Jesus, it's an angel. I, I, well, I'm, I'm genuinely interested as to, you, as to whether you actually believe this. I do. I don't understand why you think I wouldn't believe Why would I waste our time if I didn't believe I in it? I have no idea. Why would I have them? I don't know. You know what? I can't, I'm not doing this anymore. I'm really pissed off. Genuinely, like, genuinely forget it. Like, I feel like you've really disrespected, you've massively disrespected, um the angels of light and it's, it's really annoying me so I, I don't want to do it anymore I hope your relationship oh, ends that would be the end of yeah my friend really well game. I don't care about that oh, just, all right. why like, I don't understand what your problem is like I haven't got a problem no I'm, I'm trying I'm to help going, I'm going along with it you, no you're not you're not taking it seriously no I, yes I am no you're not yes I am no you're not yes, Dan Dan you're not <laughs> you're n- look you're laughing you're not taking. I'm not laughing. I'm genuinely. Well, I am actually quite upset. I'm going to go home okay, tonight okay. and apologise to each and every one of the cards. I, and the problem is, okay, well, that, you think that's funny, and that's not funny. You started laughing. You started laughing when you said that. So you must think it's funny as well. No, it's not, but I don't think it's funny. I'm at Dan. Dan, Dan I don't he's think at it's James Bar, at I'm James Bar. Can you say sorry, please? There's 52 Angel of Light cards. You need to say sorry. There's 52. 52. What for you, one? One for every week. You need to say sorry 52 times. Well, now I'm in Chile's to why there's 52. Oh, so now you want to do it. Well, I'm sorry, <laughs> but they're not interested. There's one for every week, right? You're going to hell. <laughs> <laughs> All right, what was that? <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's see.